guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a what is on my iPhone 6 video and I haven't done one of these for a while but you guys seem to be interested in me filming it so I'm going to be doing this. Um, in no way am I trying to brag, this is just a very popular video to do so I just thought you guys would enjoy it and I like watching them, I think they're kind of helpful sometimes. So. Anyways, I don't want to make this too long since this video is going to be long, so I hope you guys will like it anyways, and let's just get started. Okay, so my phone is the iPhone 6 in silver, and just the 6, not the 6 Plus. And by the way, I'm sorry that I am like sniffly or sounding weird, it's because I have allergies at the moment, so just like disregard that. Anyways, the case I have on it is the white and gray commuter um, otter box, and I got this for my birthday, so... Yeah, pretty cool. I like it a lot. It's super protective and um, yeah, it works really well. And But it does get dirty really, really easily. Anyways, um, as you see, I'm going to be putting this fancy schmancy thing up on the screen. Anyways, let's just get started. Um, my lock screen is a picture of flowers. I don't, I think I saw this on Tumblr, so I decided to uh, pick that up because I just thought that was really cute and I like it a lot. So then I'm just going to use my thumbprint to get into my phone and on my phone I have two pages and this fancy search thing with the new iOS stuff going on, all this cool stuff. Okay, so on the first page I have most of the apps that just come with the phone, so photos, camera, weather, clock, notes, reminders, blah, blah, blah. And then when it starts to get to the apps that I've downloaded myself, I have my bell because I am with bell for my provider. And then I have Instagram, and you guys should definitely follow me on Instagram. I have a public Instagram just for my YouTube, and it's called Bright Beauty with two Y's. And I do also have a personal Instagram, but I'm not going to let you follow it just because it's only for people that I know personally or that are my friends or family. So I'm sorry, but I don't really like to accept people that I don't know in person. But this is my Instagram. I have a lot of pictures on there, or a good amount, so I mean, yeah, you should definitely follow that. Next, I have Snapchat, and my Snapchat is private, but um, maybe I'll like release my Snapchat soon. So yeah, it's pretty cool. You can take some cool stuff on there. There's the there's the Snapchat filter stuff going on, and this is a new one. Whoa! But I use Snapchat a lot, and I absolutely love Snapchat. Next, I have Twitter, and you should definitely follow me. My username is at brightbeauty with three Y's, and um, this one is not private, so this is like my full-on Twitter that I use all the time, so you should definitely check it out. I'm always tweeting, I'm always retweeting, I'm always doing stuff, so definitely check out my Twitter. Next, I have YouTube, obviously, because I like to check on my YouTube account on my phone a lot. And you should definitely subscribe because you're watching YouTube right now, so bam. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I just like to go through my um, subscription box, check on my channel, what's going on. Um, I know I haven't posted a video in a couple weeks, but that's just because I decided to take a break just to organize myself, get myself together, plan some videos, and I'm ready to go. Next, I have Ask FM, which is private, but Ask FM is pretty cool. You kind of just like go and ask people questions. It's kind of boring, but kind of just have it there. Um, in case I get questions. My next app is PicFX and this is an editing app and let's see, let's let's take a let's use a picture here. So let's say I want to edit this picture. You can crop it like so if you want and then you can go through filters and I really like PFX5 and then you just bring it down or up if you want. Um, I also like to use VSTO Cam, but recently I've been using um, PickFX at the moment. And then I have Wattpad, which is for like reading fan fictions and stuff. And then I have this folder called Extras, which is just a bunch of like apps that came with Apple, so I'm not going to go through that. Oh, and my lock screen, or my home screen, is like a white bed. And I think it looks really nice just because I think it looks very crisp and clean just for the back of my thing. I like to have a lot of just solid things for the back of my screen. And then the bottom dock is messages, um, calendar, and music. And I actually have been using calendar so much recently because of a YouTuber. Um, her name's Charlotte or IDK Lottie. You should definitely check her out. She deserves way more subscribers than she has. Um, she's so professional. She's really creative and she has amazing videos. Shout out to you girl if you're watching this because she kind of opened me up to using the calendar on your phone and on your computer. Um, 
you can see it right there anyways um but I think this is really good just because like you can literally schedule your whole life into it you can schedule with school you can schedule with YouTube Next page I have pics why is VSCO cam not in there no idea but I have molded which is like a collage app square ready which is like obviously you know what square ready is um, and then I have aviary which is really nice for editing I like it a lot you should check that out it's free music musically um, photo which is for get gifs you should check out photo my username is baby Del pickle I'll show you my little um, account quickly because GIFs are so fun to make. Like, I'll show you my account. It's very interesting and very fun. So I have this one of kind of like rain going down the screen. I have this one just of like me. I have this one with like this cool fall border. This one of me like zipping my purse. Zipping my purse open and closed. Um, me, this is some from the aquarium. Pick Collage, which is another collage app. And Glitche, which is a cool app. You can... Kylie Jenner, I think, uses this. Next, I have Battery Doctor, which is really cool because it cleans out your phone. Like, if my phone was running out of storage so much before, but then, like, after using this, it would really clean out a bunch of junk that I had in. So I would definitely re recommend this. It's called Battery Doctor. And then I have the Cineplex app just, just to buy my... my just to buy my movie tickets or, like... Um, see what movies are coming out. Uh, the Demi Lovato app, which is really making me mad at the moment because it's like, says it would update in October, but it hasn't updated and I can't play it. I haven't played it for like two months, so I'm really mad about that. Uh, then I have Facebook, which is private. Memorize, which is for school. It's kind of for me. Like, my teacher uses it for us to learn French on, my French teacher, so... Yeah. Then I have Facebook Messenger, Netflix, because Netflix, obviously, right now I'm kind of rewatching ish 90210. Gotta love that show. Um, it's pretty dramatic. It's kind of like the worst version of Gossip Girl in California. I don't know. Gossip Girl is the top, but I mean, 90210 is a good one if you're kind of into Gossip Girl, but like the west coast version and then i have perfect 365 which is really funny because you can add like virtual makeup onto yourself and sometimes if you're feeling like you're like you're looking a little strange in a picture you can fix that or you can just completely overdo it and look really crazy and funny i love that app and then uber which is just in case like or not just in case which is if you want to ride it's kind of like a fancy taxi service and i've used uber like multiple multiple times then i have word reference which is like another french dictionary app Time Play, which is for the theater, like it's a little game you play. Um, Tumblr, gotta love Tumblr. You can look at mine if you want. Mine is Bright Beauty with two Y's. I changed my username just because I'm more YouTube oriented and you guys can like check out mine. And then let's just see. This is my little Tumblr account. And Ticketmaster, if I'm ever feeling like you want to check out any concerts coming out, then I will check that. And yeah. So that is what's on my iPhone. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and um, click subscribe because if you like my channel. And um, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you did like it. And if you have any requests, leave them in the description box. And I will see you guys next time. Ta-ta! Touch.